Number families show the relationship between addition and subtraction. Each number family is a combination of numbers that fit together. Introduce kids to the number family that has a combination of three numbers, 4, 6, and 10. In this example of a base 10 frame, 4 plus 6 equals 10. 4 circles plus 6 circles equals 10 circles. Now show kids how the same number family with a combination of 4, 6, and 10 is used for subtraction. 10, all the circles together, 10 minus 6 blue circles equals 4. So 10 take away 6 equals 4. Now have kids complete the number family that has the combination numbers of 2, 8, and 10. So now it's time to have kids complete a base 10 frame activity with the number family 2, 8, and 10. So pick any two colors, crayons or felt pens. I have chosen both a green and a pink. So my first one says 2 plus 8. So I'm going to do two circles, pink, 1, 2, and then I'm going to highlight the 2 because the 2 will always be pink. Then I have 8, and that will be my second color, which will be green. So fill in all of these. So that's 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. So that's 2, 1, 2, plus 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So 2 plus 8 equals 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And now we'll complete the subtraction 10 frame activity with the number family 2, 8, and 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, minus, remember 8 what consisted of the green circles. So 10 minus 8, let's minus them, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 equals 2. 1, 2. So 10 all together minus 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 are gone. And 2, 1, 2 are left. We've looked at two ways that 4, 6, and 10 fit together. Now let's look at two more. Six blue circles plus four orange circles equals 10. And 10 minus four orange circles equals six circles. Now it's time to have kids finish the last two activities for the number family 2, 8, and 10. 
And this is an example of the completed activities. 8 plus 2 equals 10, and 10 minus 2 equals 8. And again, only those three numbers were used for all of the activities. 8, 2, and 10. If kids need additional practice, review these four activities with the number family 3, 7, and 10. Now have kids complete this practice page, have them choose two colors, and then fill in the circles according to the equations. And here's an example of a completed practice page. If kids need more practice using base 10 frames, Visit the video Teaching Kids Addition and Subtraction Using Base 10 Frames. Great for parents of elementary kids. I also use number bonds to teach kids about math families. In this example, 4 plus 6 equals 10 and 6 plus 4 equals 10. Okay, now have kids complete each addition number bond. So remember, the two smaller circles have to add up to the number that is in the larger circle. So, 6 plus m mm equals 10. So, 6 plus 4 equals 10. Then, when we go down here, if 4 is here, then we know this will be 6 because this is our number combination. So 4 plus 6 equals 10. Now our numbers are changing, so this is another number combination. So 7 plus m mm equals 10. 7 plus 3 equals 10. If 7 plus 3 equals 10, then 3 plus, let me get my other pen, 7 equals 10. So those are the three numbers in that combination, 3, 7, 10. Let's look at another combination that adds up to 10. 2 plus m mm equals 10. That would be 8. And then if 2 plus 8 equals 10, then 8 plus 2 equals 10. So let's now let's review our number combinations. 4 plus 6 equals 10 and 6 plus 4 equals 10. So our number combination is 4, 6 and 10. Now we're going to a different number combination. 3 plus 7 equals 10. 7 plus 3 equals 10. And our number combination is 3, 7, 10. Now 2 plus 8 equals 10. And 8 plus 2 equals 10. Our number combination, 2, 8, 10. Now have kids fill out the addition number bond. 
Next, I introduce the subtraction number bond to kids. And the number family is 4, 6, and 10. The large circle now is on the left side with the largest number, 10. And the two smaller circles are on the right side because we are taking away. So in this First equation, 10 minus 6 equals 4, and then the reverse, 10 minus 4 equals 6. Now introduce kids to the subtraction number bonds. Have them complete each subtraction number bond. So remember, now the large number is on this side because we are taking from it. So 10 minus 6 equals 4. Since this is the same number combination, we need the same numbers that we have above here. So if 10 minus 6 equals 4, then 10 minus 4 will equal 6. Let's go to our next one. 10 minus 7 equals 3. And if 10 minus 7 equals 3, then 10 minus 3 equals 7. And then we go over here. 10 minus 8 equals 2. And if 10 minus 8 equals 2, then 10 minus 2 equals 8. So our number bonds consist of a combination of three letters. In these two, it is 10, 6, and 4. In these, 10, 7, and 3. And in these, 10, 8, and 2. And on this side, these two numbers always equal the larger number. Now have kids complete each subtraction number bond. This next activity combines the addition number bond with the subtraction number bond and shows both in one number bond. So on the left side is the addition for plus 6 equals 10 and 6 plus 4 equals 10. And on the right side are the subtraction equations. 10 minus 6 equals 4 and 10 minus 4 equals 6 using the numbers 4, 6, and 10 for both addition and subtraction problems. And here is a second Example of a combined number bond using the numbers 3, 7, and 10. On the left-hand side, you have addition. 3 plus 7 equals 10, and 7 plus 3 equals 10. And on the right side, you have subtraction. 10 minus 7 equals 3, and 10 minus 3 equals 10. Seven. Then have kids complete this addition subtraction number bond. And when they're ready, have them make and complete their own number bonds. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe. And as always, I will list the link for all the templates in the description section.